Before I do my parasite detoxing, this is what I crave. Sweet more sweets. More sweets. Even more sweets. Parasites love sweets. So when you're craving sweets, you have to feed them. So they're like, go to the fridge and eat more sweets. But after I'm done with my parasite detoxing, I crave fruits, 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 and more fruits, and more fruits, and veggies too, and more fruit. So just check your fridge. If your fridge is more sweets than fruits, then you probably have parasites. I'm just saying. And this is what I use to do my parasite detoxing. Parasite detox with a binder. Parasite detox contains wormwood, clove, and walnut hull. Never do a parasite detox without a binder. You will find yourself most likely deathly ill, having to live in the bathroom, and not being able to function. When parasites die in your body, what happens? A little bit like these plants. They just stay in one spot. They stay in your body, and they release those toxin gases, chemicals, heavy metals. They're not going out of your body, so you're repoisoning yourself. That's why some people that do a parasite detox without a binder end up in the hospital. A binder safely binds those things and removes them out of your system, allowing you to safely cleanse from unwanted organisms. So, yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty much it.